afternoon. This is Dorothy Simon sitting in for Jim Lakey over here at Cable Channel 3. And you can also get us on the web at sandylandcenter.org. And like I say, you can come and see us live. Come in and visit us over on the south side of the square. Come in for coffee. And we also have a lot of medical equipment. If you are out there in need of, you may want to investigate that further. We do have um, medical equipment on loan if you so need. But today's weather pattern, it's, uh, there's some high pressures that are emanating from over the Great Lakes and this sets in a pattern f um, for the weather all across the Midwest. And This high pressure is bringing in some cooler and drier air. This morning the air was rather cooler than yesterday morning. Uh, it was right in the 70s, whereas yesterday morning it was in the 90s. Incredible. Uh, this dry air will be all over the um, Midwest. And the Plains region, therefore, will be hot today, very hot, with highs in the 80s to the 100s from Kansas to South Dakota. And for the next six hours or so, we can expect some sunny dry conditions with the wind speed increasing somewhat. But right now in the square it's a sunny balm in 95 degrees with a humidity of 46 degrees, 46 percent. Southerly winds at 13 miles per hour. And for today we can expect a high of 101 and later on this evening the temperature should fall back to the 75 degrees with the humidity is uh, over 50%, 50 to 60 percent humidity. The pollen count for tomorrow and Sunday, for today and tomorrow is high, but for Sunday and Monday it should be uh, moderate, so some good relief if you suffer from any allergies due to the pollen in the air. The weekend weather uh, calls for sunny with no rain in the forecast. Saturday we should have a high of 100 degrees and a low of 68. Sunday a high of 90 and a low of 62 with some isolated thunderstorms. So it's cooler weather and it's good weather for family outdoor activities and we should have quite a bit of that this weekend and next weekend with the Stafford Fair. But we have some birthday today. Um, we want to wish um, Sammy Grisman a happy birthday and uh, Damon Stevenson. Happy birthday to both. And then uh, anniversary greetings to Sean and Sally Rosenberg. Happy anniversary to both of you. And on Sunday we have a happy birthday for LaDonna Garcia. And on Monday, happy birthday for Milton John. So if you see these people in the square or the shopping center or the post office, wish them all good greetings. Uh, we have a busy weekend coming up in our community of what the Stafford Fair. The rodeo is the kickoff of the week of activities for the Stafford Fair. And that starts tonight. Uh, with the rodeo and uh, on, on Saturday night um, Jake Jill, a country rock musician, will be in concert and this concert is for worthy cause, it's for the um, victims of the um, Oklahoma tornado. So please if you were attending or didn't mean to attend, please attend this concert for a good cause, for the victims of the Oklahoma tornado. And of course the rodeo is there with all the activities that go on with that. And on Sunday there should be a demolition derby. And on Wednesday starts the Stafford Fair in earnest. Um, Wednesday there's a hamburger feast and a watermelon to go with that, very cooling on a hot summer's day and lots of other activities. Those are just some of the highlights. On Thursday there should be the Community Appreciation Night for the 4-H Club and they serve some excellent ice cream. 
and you can get all the ice cream you can eat and it's very good ice cream so make sure you do that and there's a birthday cake contest that goes along with that and on Friday um, there's a kids craft lessons that's just part of the activities along with the um, judging of the animals and all that goes on the fair so get yourself a calendar and make sure you attend some of those activities and on Saturday morning there's a community breakfast that is sponsored by the Chamber of Commerce so there's something for everyone it makes for a fun week um, week of activities uh, today over at the Max, Maxville Center they're serving roast beef roast with gravy sweet potatoes Italian vegetables and rolls and a frosted lime gelatin dessert and on the 15th they will serve a Salisbury steak a pasta salad with vegetables a toss salad with green peppers and carrots bread and peaches and on Tuesday they will serve oven fried chicken, mashed potatoes, stewed tomatoes, rolls and sherbet. All very appetizing. And at the Sunflower Center, today they're serving a weighed chicken with rice, mixed vegetables and coleslaw. And they will have some other enticing menus that we will inform you of later. And our thought for the day. If your day is hemmed in with prayer, it is less likely to unravel. If it is hemmed in with prayer, it is less likely to unravel. And remember, don't pray unless you believe God will answer. So have a great weekend and visit all the activities at the rodeo and the Stafford Fair. Keep cool.